Hello, and welcome to Storytime for Kids. Today we're going to read If You Give a Pig a Party. And if you know my channel, you will know I have a couple of these books already, and there are a lot more coming up. So if you like this book, please check the description below, and don't forget to subscribe, okay? <laughs> Here we go. If you give a pig a party, she's going to ask for some balloons. When you give her the balloons, she'll want to decorate the house. When she's finished, she'll put on her favorite dress. Then she'll call all her friends to invite them to the party. Her friends won't be home. So you'll go with her to look for them. On the way, she'll see a street fair. She'll want you to take her on the bumper cars. All her friends will be there. Then you have to take her on all the rides. She'll want to play all the games too. When she's done, she'll ask you for some ice cream. When she's finished eating the ice cream, she'll need to change her clothes. You'll have to take her home. She'll ask her friends to come along. <laughs> On the way, she'll start a game of hide and seek. Oh, one is here and, and the piggy is here. Oh, there's one more here. Oh, and a rabbit. <laughs> oh, look, and the moose is here. And the little miles. When you finally get home, you'll have to make dinner. Then she'll want to have a sleepover. You'll have to find pajamas. And blankets and pillows for everyone. When she sees the pillows, She'll probably start a pillow fight. Then she'll make a fortress out of blankets. Of course, when she's finished, she'll want to decorate it. So she'll ask for some balloons. And chances are, if you give her some balloons... She's going to ask you for a party. <laughs> the end. What an imagination. These books are so funny. Thank you so much for listening. And I will see you soon.